The arowana is a feisty. Woo! And of course, over here to the side, we have our three. There it goes. Take one. I'm terrified. <laughs> There's so many fish right there on the bank. Anything in there? We got, oh, we got a fish! What is going on, girls? Welcome back to another video. We are here right outside of Universal. This is a very obviously well-known tourist vacation area. Disney's here, you got Islands of Adventures, you got all these crazy rides, which we will be experiencing. Roll the clip. That's just what's about to happen here soon. We haven't experienced it yet, but they got to see it. That's editing. You just farted. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. We've got a trap. If you're wondering how the heck we got this trap, well, let me catch you up to speed. I've never seen a more populated Walmart in my entire life, dude. This is a little frightening. I feel this claustrophobic. This is the most packed Walmart I've ever been in my entire Well, I guess we are next to Disney. That yeah, makes sense. Why. That'd be why. Anyway, we're at Walmart. This is where we're going to get everything we need to catch fish. Perfect fish traps. Oh my gosh, that actually is top tier better. Will you just look at all random things we could like that's a fish trap oh yeah i just hit you with that can this oh can this get any louder build your own trap today because they don't have any we don't need this we, we were going to buy a fish trap but then we looked and they didn't have any so now we have a razor blade zip ties and stay right here i have no idea where he's going we're gonna find out here in just a second be pet <gasps> Dude, that thing just came flying <laughs> over the aisle. <laughs> no, oh yeah. my gosh. Is that our, that's actually sick. No, I've uh, never seen one of these at Walmart before. All we do is chop the Dude, this is so sick. We're going to make a custom oh, fish trap. Why is it so per good? usual. I mean, we always do the custom fish traps. Dude, it's got like a whole like launch handle. I know. I kind of like the shape. Oh my gosh. Well, guys, we got everything we need to make this fish trap. These are the three materials. If you did want to try this yourself. Now, I think it's only right that we fit in. So we, uh, oh my goodness. Yeah, <laughs> it's the visor, look. dude. <laughs> we got this for our bobber to tie off to. So Mickey's yeah, gonna be our bobber. What hat do we need? We need a hat. There we go. Oh. Oh my gosh, if you had Tinder, this would be your profile picture. Just like that, just like that. <laughs> hey. We're here. Jay Kwon, get in the spirit. Okay, you didn't buy me a hat. Oh, you hat. didn't forget to get them hats. I got my hat. Ah! Welcome to the parking lot of Universal. We're here. Gotta love Universal, man. I know we're wearing Disney hats, and the title of this video is probably Fish Traps at Disney. That's a key word. I need it for the algorithm. Let's just be honest here. <laughs> We do love Disney though. Mickey Mouse is clutching it up today. He's actually gonna be our anchor to our fish trap. We just got back from Walmart. Now what we gotta do is set up our fish trap and hopefully catch some fish. We're outside of a big old lake right outside of the entire theme park. Now of course, Disney Universal, these are all literally in the same vicinity. So regardless, you're in the mix of the tourism zone. That's what yeah, I meant. That's what I was trying go. to come up with there. there you go. Top of the bottle is done. You just gotta flip it around, put it upside down. This is the most generic fish trap, but we're doing it because we know it works. Because this of, is, because of the go science. We're science it proves science. that it works. That's, that's, printed, that's good, printed, that's good. You're gonna break the plate, we only have one. It might be better than the ones you make at home. We just made it in a parking garage. We might not need Mickey Mouse attached to the trap, but where I will put Mickey Mouse, he is zip tied to the parking garage post. If any of you ever come here and find this, send me a picture. Oh. One thing I've learned is that a pancake? Yeah, oh. it's one of the fish's favorite food because they do need food inside of the trap. It's just like bread. It will work. You this got is a point. the same thing as bread. I didn't even think about bait, but we had pancakes somehow. Brenton found these. Bait is inside. Now all we gotta do is go put it in the lake. And now we're back right here in front of this massive lake right outside of all of these theme parks and uh, we've got a trap. That was awesome. Yes. That was so cool. With pancakes in it, which is literally fuego bait. Brenton, 
tell me where to put it. I'm going out. Yeah, I know, I know exactly where to put it. So I've studied this pond because I used to do marine biology when I was in college. Yep. So I studied a lot of the northern Florida area, especially Orlando, Tampa. Yep. Uh, Disney theme parks is something tell we specialize in. can put it, dude. Okay. Uh, so there is, <laughs> uh, there's three tarpon that I've seen normally west of here, which is crazy that there's tarpon in here. So I'd put it east. Okay. Got what it. would, what? Let's go in, fellas. Oh, sinking. This is full of alligators. Oh. So that's always cool to know. Uh, it's something I always try and think about before I get in the water. Is it filled with alligators? Is it not? Uh, normally, if it if it is, we don't go in. In this case, Paul's going in. So we're gonna leave that there. Roll it, cut to cut to whatever Paul's doing. I can't hear him. <laughs> Never thought I'd be uh, swimming in the water uh, by Disney Universal. This right here is a good spot. It's honestly really really deep. The trap with water. You gotta fill up the trap first. Only way to get this thing to sink. There it goes. How you doing? Oh yeah. Trap sinking. That's good. It's supposed to do that, it's not a surprise. This water's actually pretty clear too. Yeah, it's a good spot. I played baseball for 15 years, kid. Yeah, you're in the wall one, I'm on land. Oh. The fish trap is out there. I can literally see it right there. I'll put an arrow where it's at. And uh, now it's time to go have some fun at the theme parks. We'll come back to this in a little bit. See if we caught any nice fish. I really think we're gonna catch some crazy stuff. No, uh, what's it called? I was telling them all about how all the alligators in here and they just spawned. So we might catch a little alligator. That would be nuts if we caught a baby alligator. All right, where do you wanna go first? I'm trying to go on that, uh, that brand new roller coaster. Take one. I'm terrified. <laughs> I'm ready to go on some rides. Taylor, you ready? Yeah. That's it, while the trap is sitting, got my Disney hat on. Not exactly uh, at Disney, but that's fine. We're in, baby. This place looks unreal. Doesn't even look real. Begins, guys. The adventure begins. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so cute. I think we start off on the Hulk. We're going on the Colt. <laughs> <laughs> but I need a warm up. You this is the warm up. Oh We're just getting goodness. started. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna pass, I'm gonna pass. Oh God. Yo, that's gonna be so fun. Was the Hulk that was it that right there was the Hulk we just absolutely mobbed on I actually had to sneak the camera bit, through yeah. the metal detector there yeah. I just put it in my waistband and it worked out so you guys got to see it thank God <laughs> all right we have just entered as you saw the entrance look at that we're going to the simulator for spider-man listen I don't know this is a different type of video this is literally more of like a vlog, but we're incorporating the fish trap thing. I really hope you guys enjoy this. Definitely out of the ordinary. Typically, I don't film things like this. So if you like it and you're enjoying this, smash the like button. This is such an iconic video right now. Aww. We are just in the mix as a family. I think my camera is supposed to go in a locker. It's called River Adventures. This place is dead today, which is perfect. It's a nice Sunday afternoon. We're walking straight through all the lines. This is the way to do it. Stay seated. We'll grab your boat at the receiving dock ahead. Do not get out of the boat. <laughs> So crazy. 
so, Taylor got off last second. She's like, I can't do it, Paul. I'm so glad she was not on this roller coaster. I know there's so many fish right there on the bank. We're here at Hogwarts. Hog mama, hog mama. First time I've ever tried butter beer. Um, gonna give it a go. I'm very picky. Wow, that's really good. I love the foam. Literal 9.2 out of 10. And it's nine dollars. Yeah, it is nine. <laughs> Cheers to butter beer. Looks like you've lost power. Oh! Oh! I've got you, don't worry. Oh! Oh! We're going backwards, baby! Oh! Right now, although we waited a decade to get in there, that was awesome. That was so worth the wait. That was an absolute blast. And it all leads us back to the exact same spot we started. It's the evening time, as you can see. A little bit more overcast, and uh, this trap's been in here all day. It actually so. floated up a little bit. It was sunken, like a sunken shipwreck that was gone forever. Yep. It is now back. It has floated up a little bit to the bank, so my hopes are low. Yep. If you just walk the bank, there's fish all over the bank here. It's crazy. This thing is flooded with fish. The amount of fish we've seen in the middle is nuts. All right, I'm going in. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Paul, quick, your camera's about to die. Hurry up. Anything in there? We got, oh, we got a fish. We got a, a largemouth. We, we got a fish. We got a fish. I see, it, I see it from right here. He's swimming around. Largemouth, it's a baby largemouth. It's, <laughs> it's the little tiny largemouth bass. Oh, baby mama, look at him. He's right there. It's a little thumper. That's oh my, <laughs> we got a fish, dude. That's sick. Our bread, I thought for sure we'd have a bluegill. There's a largemouth bass in there though. There's two, there's one, there's another one right there. There's another one? There's another one right there. Look at him swimming. Oh my gosh. Oh my oh. gosh. Got it. Well, fellas, um, we caught a fish. Let's see how many we got total. Look at all the pancake. Come on out, fish. Oh yeah, look at him. Right there, dude. That's epic. Little baby largemouth bass. Oh. Look at how tiny. That is a future double digit bass. Absolute mondo. Oh, that's a big one. You, see really quick? you want to lip them? Here, where's the other one? Oh my goodness, they're so cute. That's like ultra small, dude. That's the smallest little large mouth I've ever seen. Oh. Those are some Disney bass. Those are, those are some Disney bass. <laughs> those are right universal there. bass. <laughs> Send them off. Oh no. Oh my god, that one just got eaten. <laughs> I can't believe we waited all day to find two small largemouth in our Yeah, trail. I was really hoping for that baby alligator. <laughs> we had a good time. And we're back home. What an adventure over to Orlando. We had such a great time. I was actually in the area. Oh, we're foggy. What's new? I was actually in the area for Animal Con, an event where I met many of you. Thank you so much for all of you coming out. Hundreds of you I met. I'm gonna video you getting a picture. <laughs> all the way from Canada. We love you. The Kuferos have such a strong fan base and I could not thank you enough for watching all these videos. Y'all know the difference between today's video and the normal video is definitely more of a vlog and I really had fun filming it. I wasn't gonna show this yet, but why not? If you made it this far into the video, I actually finished up in here. Uh, we have all of the turtle tubs, of course, right here. And then we put a little bench in the middle which is gonna be awesome for obviously PCAquatics.shop. I have all the little tags we need and everything to ship these turtles out, I cannot wait. And of course over here to the side we have our three different bins for tortoises. I haven't made the housing for them or anything other than just kind of the, the basic setup so far. But things are happening at the farm per usual. There's always projects going on and this is looking amazing. Definitely blew away my expectations, that's for sure. Even from the outside, it just looks so good. Real quick as well, I wanna show you the 5,000 gallon. My goodness, the fish looks so good. They just look so, so good. The Air One is a feisty. Whoa! The Air One is a feisty little guy now. He doesn't play around anymore. Right, Beast? is getting huge. All the fish look amazing. Yes! 
We love to see it. I also got a new aerator in there, so it's really pumping around that media now. It just looks so, so good over here. The new filter, I mean everything. It's off the dock finally. I wanna thank all those who have watched the video up until this point. Y'all are the OGs, the real ones, the ones who allow me to do everything that I do and make these videos for you guys. So comment your shirt size down below, the color that you want, and then a reason why you love the channel. And I'm gonna pick one winner out of this video's comment section to give a shirt to. These ain't even released yet. These are the ones that you'll eventually be able to get on PC Aquatics, but that, like I said, the site's not live yet, so you'll have a shirt that no one else has. Comment down below. Here's an update on the saltwater pond. We just did actually some water tests. Everything looks good, which is important. That's very, very good. We're keeping up on this pond. I got a mangrove light in the back. As you can see, we're about to get a mister for the mangrove as well. The pond looks so clear. Look at all our little snails. They're kind of spread out throughout the entire pond. But the 4,000 gallon saltwater pond is doing good and soon, getting its first little bit of fish, the test fish of course, but uh, yeah, that's coming very, very soon. We're gonna get some damsels, we'll put those in, see how they react, see how they do. If they do good, then we are ready for the big baby mamas. We all have been waiting on that, so once that video comes, it's gonna be awesome. Sorry, I got, I got distracted. I get distracted so easily. I realized that about myself. Is anyone else? See, I just got distracted, that's it. It's a nice jet though. Of course, I'm cooking up another banger already, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that. The goats and myself will see you right back here at the farm in the very next video. They don't go anywhere. <laughs>